Well, back to another player review. This season on FIFA 20, uh, the player reviews I'll do will probably be every. I'll try and do most SPL players who get because they're so like. I mean, it'll be like an SPL player like every six team of weeks, and also I'll do Scottish players. And last uh, week we had Defoe. He was all right. But he's like, he, I mean, he's alright, like, but again, he's like unusable for weekend league, or if you want to actually fucking, I mean, for a laugh, I why not? But John again, I've just thrown this Premier League team together, trying to do the icon swap objective thing. Um, but yeah, John again, let's go through his card. We have got decent pace. Uh, his shooting's alright, his long shots, his power, his follies. I think he should have better finishing, to be honest. I think this card's done him dirty. His passing, yeah, alright, uh, I think that's fair enough, but. Because, like, his passing and fission is good, but his free kick and crossing. Uh, his dribbling, he's got good agility and balance. He's got good reactions, good ball control and dribbling in itself. He's got great stamina. Obviously, he's box to box. And he's got, I mean, he's just an all round decent guard. We're going to be just playing him in the centre cam role. Packed Ericsson earlier, packed Red Wijnaldum, and we also got uh, Red Lewandowski. So that was no bad, but we've got player of the month Pukey up front, and hopefully we can get the job done here and be singing in the rain. Going into the first game, what is this guy's team going to look like? It's a pretty standard uh, Liga BV <laughs> BVVA. Ah, uh, so <coughs> Jesus. Christ. Uh, 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 Rodrigo, Anaki Williams, Saul, Parte. It's decent, like. I mean, it's better than my team, but not my actual team. Better than this team I'm rocking up with, but we probably have Ericsson, Pukey, probably overall better than the rest of these fucking jobbers. Ben finds Mezzo Ozzo. This guy can find the pass. He finds John McGinn, who's just going to burst into that pace. Great ball across, but yet again, no one on the end of it, so it's not McGinn's fault. Oh yes, Pukey has somehow got it in. John McGinn, not even in fault, but fuck it, I'll still include the goal in the highlights because I'm that damn good. He's gave a penalty for fucking what? Matt Ritchie can't believe it, and to be honest, now I can fucking eye. I mean, it doesn't even show you why, like, because the game's fucking rigged. It's a joke, and now, where's, uh, he's aiming right, so he's probably gonna go left. Yeah. And I, and I went right anyway, even though I read it. Fuck. Sick! This game's shit! Come on, which Naldon, man. Fucking find someone. Why can, why is this team so bad? How lucky do you have to fucking get? Seriously, see that one in? I'd have fucking killed someone. Mon Royce. Oh, fuck off. Wait. See, I do it my defenders. Oh, red card. I mean, how do you fucking even do it? This game's bullshit. Fucking make a run, you. You big dote it fuck. McGinn. Ericsson. Yes, McGinn with the assist, Ericsson with the finish, and it is 2-1, and that is fantastic, Christian Ericsson, what a finish, that was top bins, big John McGinn with the assist, that's what I'm talking about, Christ, that was going to go to McGinn, who cares though, we got the win, McGinn gets an assist, decent performance I guess, against Allen's a bit of a worry, we've got Payet, we've got Martial, we've got Lozano, the defence, I'm not really too bothered about that, that looks pissed, but... Just depends on what this guy is like at the game. Thinking attack straight away. The break is definitely on. And Lozano has chipped this and it's fucking pish. This guy's shite as well, like yeah, I should be fucking beating him. Fuck me, mate, you're shocking. Out to Richie. Matt Richie. Whips it across. Someone. Fucking McGinn! Oh John McGinn! Ericsson! Fuck off, how's he saved that? 2-0, fucking pish, I'm ready to kill some cunts, see, see the next person walks through my fucking front door, I'm going to kill them, right, because, I mean, this is definitely their fault and not mine, because I'm fucking great and not pish. Guys, come on to fuck, someone turn up here, this Balo Toure, fuck. Apparently, but fucking time, no, there's only one man who's taking this, and it's fucking John McGinn. John McGinn, where are you going? 
It's John McGinn. John McGinn! 2 1. Back in it. Big John. We're going to get a thumbnail here. Go to the camera. Go to the. Oh no, mate. He's bottled the camera. What's he doing? Oh no. Oh no. We're in play here with that interception. John McGinn! John McGinn! So easy oh! Possession. Lovely bit of skill! John McGinn! Royce! Woohoo! That's what I'm talking about. Two each. John McGinn with the fucking the greatest run you'll ever see in your life. So it's definitely worth 12k in that department. And oh fuck off, Doherty! Yeah, don't hit me, bastard! I mean, what is that? Fucking no need whatsoever. No need. No need. Where's this guy going? He's looking down the middle, he's looking right, he's looking right, he's looking right and he's fucking buried it in the advertising board. Thank God. Yo mate, you've got about 8 chances doing this fucking- How's this carer prick fucking quicker than him? This game's a load of shite and he goes fucking stick a boot for him. Hey, my fucking Richie, what you doing? No, come on, flick that. Sancho, McGinn! Fuck me, if McGinn scored that, that would have been a perfect ending. But sadly, it's 2 each. And it's not what the doctor ordered. Jesus Christ almighty. McGinn got mad of the match. If that counts for anything towards the player review, but yeah. Depressing to draw that. Because a draw helps no one when, you're both, when you both need a win. I, like, literally need a win for this icon swap business. We'll go into big, uh see what he did. So John McGinn, he played two games and he got one goal and two assists now to be honest, that is good. I can't I can't necessarily complain with that and his birthday's one day after mine which is uh, pretty great but if you do the math, the Scott Steiner math right, well no, not the Scott Steiner math right, um, those two guys coming against weren't great and they also had shit teams so if you look at it like that, he's kind of against who he should be against and to be honest he performed well, but this guy, you're not going to be able to stick him in a foot champs team, you know what I mean, you're not going to be able to, but if you have a, a, a job or BPL team that you, you'd like a wee in for him just to spice up your life a wee bit, uh, yeah, this guy's probably the guy for it, but I wouldn't play him calm. Well, he, he, he can do, the, I mean, I've just shown you, he can do the job calm, but I think he's definitely more suited to a centre mid box to boxer than an actual cam. But anyway, that'll do it for the job again. I think I gave the foe a 5 out of 10, but McGinn was a lot better on the ball um, and shit like that but I'll give him again a solid 6 out of 10 I think he was alright like but don't know I don't know what's going to happen but anyway 6 out of 10 until next time